Hello everyone and welcome to episode 120 of the ASA, my Q&A series where I answer your questions. Today's going to be a short episode because I only got three episodes, but that's kind of nice because I literally just got back from a little vacation. Anyways, let's get started with Monik. I'm not sure if I said that right. Probably didn't. What's your favorite fan film that came out in the past few weeks for May the 4th? To be honest, I don't actually have one because I don't really watch fan films of Star Wars projects or movies movies, shows, anything. I just don't really ever get into that. I've only ever seen maybe like two or three that I'm like, hey, that was kind of cool, but I typically don't really watch fan films and all that, so don't have one. Sorry. Pretty weenie. Next question is from Crimson Toaster. ASA, what did you think of that Crimson Toaster Sky Ren stream? And then he also says, also, I think that's supposed to be meant even more obscure. I, I don't know what you mean by that. Sorry. And then a bunch of beautiful potatoes. Thank you for the potatoes. Now, to answer your question, the stream was very fun. I enjoyed it. I was very weird and like always I make people uncomfortable, which is fun to do because well, when in doubt, why not, right? And that's what I did. I like to be weird. I talked about things like Harris and Dula and it made him uncomfortable and it was very funny. Embrace the insanity. I did years ago and I'm fine. Uh -huh. A few moments later. Find my Harrison Dula. <sighs> hey, I do it to brick collection too, so you're not the only one. I never and said then, I was happy about it. And then it. he gets mad at me and he says, Why? Why you always gotta bring Harrison Dula into this? Blah, blah, blah. Well, why do you? Because she's a fox. Last question is from B Brick Abel. ASA, first of all, fries. Thank you for the fries. What's your opinion on the Lord of the Rings sets after you sent one back to Lego? Yeah, that was fun. I kind of wish I could have kept that set. You know, I still haven't gotten my ATAT, -AT, but that's the topic for another time. <laughs> I've always liked Lego Lord of the Rings. I've always thought Lego Lord of the Rings was a really cool theme. I'm just too much involved with Lego Star Wars to be like, oh, I'll get a little bit of both because I like to get pretty much every single Lego Star Wars set and that's already very expensive. So if I started getting into like Lego Lord of the Rings or even another theme as well as Star Wars, I would have to sacrifice and maybe get less Star Wars and I don't want to do that. Even though I love Lego the Lord of the Rings, I'm not going to stop buying Lego Star Wars and I'm not going to buy a little bit of both. Lego Lord of the Rings a very fantastic theme and I love it. And that new Eye of Sauron, oh my gosh, is it beautiful. I tried to convince my sister to get it just so I could have it in my house and see it and be like, oh, it's so beautiful. I even offered to help pay for it, like pay half and she still didn't go for it. So it's not fair. Very sad, but it's beautiful and I love it. And maybe someday I'll get lucky enough to see someone have it in person so I can see it because I would love to see that thing in real life. It, it's just, it's so cool. Does that answer your question? Probably not, but if you need me to go into more detail, just ask a little bit different but ask the same question again does that is, does that make sense i don't know i'm in a weird mood today i've been up since 2 a.m so i'm gonna go now thank you all very much for watching thanks for all your wonderful support i appreciate each and every one of you if you have a question or two for the next episode leave it down below leave a like while you're down there and maybe consider checking out some of my more recent lego star wars shorts like the sith infiltrator it's available in the cards have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys next time goodbye